Even after hitting multiple cars along Southeast 15th, the bus driver continued along this hill, smashing into this railroad bridge. I looked at it again, I said, uh, I don't think somebody might have made it out of this one. It just looks too bad to me. Police say 58-year-old Middale school bus driver Otis Pitts, who was on his way to pick up students, was weaving in and out of traffic along Southeast 15th Street from I-35 to Santa Fe. The bus swerved and caused four separate accidents. Investigators say it doesn't appear that Pitts was speeding. When I came down, seen the truck flipped up, the car up against the curb, but not, like I said, I never seen nothing like this on this street before. Several people were hurt, one person with a serious neck injury, and another may have to have a hand amputated. Yeah, I am amazed that we don't have more serious injuries. Uh, you take 8 o'clock in the morning uh, on a school day morning, and you've got a school bus driving down the street in that type of condition. Uh, you know, a school bus is a big vehicle and carries a lot of mass behind it. If it strikes a smaller vehicle or whatever, then, then you've got serious injuries. Police say Pitts had some type of medical emergency before ultimately slamming into a railroad bridge where they found him unconscious. They also found drugs on the school bus. Pitts was arrested on complaints of driving under the influence and leaving the scene of an injury accident. He will stay in the hospital overnight before being booked into jail. Oklahoma City Police are still investigating, not specifying what type of drug was found on the bus. Reporting in Southeast Oklahoma City, Heather Hope, News 9.